Hello, I'm Sean Jones. Welcome to your week in tech. Listable, the London-based startup which transforms how companies connect with freelancers, businesses and services, secured $1.5 million led by America's Valar Ventures. Alternative London foreign exchange business Camtox has secured an $11 million Series B round led by Partec Ventures. This takes the total funding to $19 million following its launch back in 2011. And the UK's largest curated online marketplace, Not on the High Street, has secured a £6 million loan from Silicon Valley Bank. The UK-based company brings together over 5,000 UK small creative businesses, offering over 170,000 products. The first fully conservative Queen's speech for two decades has outlined cyber security measures and put small business at the forefront. There are going to be new laws to give police and spies greater powers to monitor internet and phone use. And the Enterprise Bill will establish a small business service to deal with B2B disputes without having to involve the courts. And the black cab, another London icon, has also caused a stir near Westminster this week. A fleet of black cabs protested against TfL in a marked movement to hit back at companies like Uber. Snapchat boss Even Spiegel has revealed his plan to take the company public rather than sell to a rival social network. Facebook had tried to buy Snapchat for $3 billion in 2013, but Spiegel turned them down. He claims almost 100 million people a day use the video messaging app, and its latest funding round valued it at a sky-high $15 billion. Our download of the week is Six Tribes. The app is a social network that lets you join tribes based on your lifestyle. So it uses your Facebook likes and the music on your phone and the places you've been to to suggest social groups. Hot off the press and in the Apple Store this week. You can download it now on iOS, but not quite yet on Android. And finally, the weather remains an ever-popular topic of British conversation. But a new app promises to reflect more of the British attitude to the weather. Authentic Weather will take the real-time weather update and translate it for you. This has been your Week in Tech. Thank you for watching. And for more, check out Tech City News and do follow us on Twitter.